Good morning, Lighthouse. It's day 11. We are halfway there. I just want to get up and do my little happy dance. One, two, two, two. <laughs> Whatever you want to do, do a little jig. You're halfway through the fast 21 days, day 11. The title of today's uh, devotion is What is Your Assignment? What's my assignment? What is my purpose in ministry? What has God created me to do? What has God gifted me to do that will bless the church, that will bless uh, the ministries of the church, that will bless the people around me? And part of the, the things that you're fasting for, this should be on your radar. What is my assignment? God, I've, I've restricted some things. I've changed the order of my day, the way I eat, and some different things. But Lord, what do you have for me? And, and, and regardless of what stage of life you're in, whether you're a teenager or or you're almost retired, we always have that question, God, am I in your perfect will? And we find here in Luke chapter 4, where it records where Jesus, it says that Jesus, full of the Holy Spirit, was led by the Spirit into the desert. And then later on down in verses 14 and 15, it says that Jesus returned to Galilee in the power of the Spirit. He was led by the Spirit, full of the Spirit when He left, when He returned from Galilee, that He was in the power of the Spirit. Before that, he said he was led by the Spirit, full of the Holy Spirit. A lot of times we are filled with the Holy Spirit, but it's not until we are actually, uh, that we operate in the power of the Holy Spirit. When we truly start to lean on God and His commands and His strength and His power, that we just don't know about God and we're just not filled with the Holy Spirit, but we truly operate in the power of the Holy Spirit. That's when we truly start to see what our assignment is, what our purpose is, and what our gift is when it comes to knowing the things of God and being used of God. Uh, in Romans chapter 12, verses 1 and 2, a very familiar passage of Scripture says, Therefore, I urge you, brothers and sisters, in the view of God's mercies, to offer your bodies as a living sacrifice. This is what, what we're doing this 21 days. Holy and pleasing to God, this is your true and proper worship. Do not conform to the pattern of this world, but be transformed by the renewing of your mind. Then you will be able to test and approve what God's will is, His good, pleasing, and perfect will. I don't want just any kind of assignment. I don't want to just feel good about what I'm doing in church. I want to know that it's God's perfect will in my life. And so my prayer for you today is this, that as you pray and as you fast, as you present your body as a holy sacrifice, physically, mentally, spiritually, and during this fasting, as we sacrifice Cokes and television and food and our diet changes a little bit, I pray that God will give you exactly what your assignment is, that you'll know without a shadow of a doubt that you're in God's will, His good and perfect, pleasing will, and that you won't just be full of the Holy Spirit, but you'll operate in the power of the Holy Spirit. God bless you, and I'll see you tomorrow.